Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest set for one fall with 30 minute time limits is the final quarterfinals match in the King of Europe Cup tournament. The winner of this match will face the anarchist Doug Williams in the semi-final round. Introducing first, representing IWA Mid-South, Okay, Dan Reed, our last quarter final. Rio Saito on the left. Matt Seidel on the right. And uh, the winner of this one meeting Doug Williams in our second semi final. One semi final already set, of course, Nigel McGuinness and Davy Richards. Now, do you think uh, Doug would prefer to wrestle Rio Saito or Matt Seidel? You know, I don't think there's a preference. If you want to win the thing, you've got to beat everyone in the tournament anyway. Yeah. So. Rio Saito representing Dragon Gate. Yep. And uh, Matt Saito represents IWA Mid South. Yep. Uh, Rio Saito trained by Ultimo Dragon. Can't um, get much better grounding than that, can you? Not really. Ladies' debut, May 11th, 1999. He's a former NWA World Welterweight Champion. He is also uh, uh, former Open the Dream Gate champion, won the Open the Dream Gate championship. Uh, he also won the Open the Triangle Gate championship five times. Um, the first three times was with Dragon Kid and Genki Horiguchi as part of the Do Fixer, and uh, the other two times was Sima and Susumu Yokusaka. Matt Seidel is also a seven year pro and. Uh He's got a good record in England. He's won all of his singles bouts in the UK, whether it be in Ring of Honor or, or elsewhere, IPW UK, 1PW, whatever it may be. And uh, also the winner of the 2005 Ted Petty Invitational. So, again, like Seven. Davey Richards, has experience of winning tournament uh, tournaments in, in, the, in wrestling. Matt Seidel, of course, has uh, competed in, uh, for Dragon Gate over in Japan as well. So these two are not strangers to one another. Not at all. But we're not in Dragon Gate. We are in the Liverpool Olympia of the King of Europe Cup. The first event of its kind. Hopefully not the last, because well, if tonight's anything like last night, we're in for an awesome night of wrestling. Absolutely, and uh, Rio Saito is not a uh, stranger to tournaments earlier. We're about Matt Seidel winning the Ted Petty Invitational. Rio Saito is actually the first ever King of the Gate tournament um, in 2005. King of Gate tournament. 
Oh, shaking a hand with the two of them trading oh, shots to the midsection now. Knife edge shots. Runs into an elbow, does that side down. Beautiful standard drop kick, though. Nicely done. Saito with, oh, beautiful wow. belly to belly Did you see suplex. The, the arch on yeah. the way he popped his hips on that belly to belly suplex. Reminiscent of the late great Owen Hart there. Yeah. So Saito with the height, slight height and weight advantage, but Saito, he's, he's used to being the uh, smaller man he's in, in a lot of his matches. Had a tag title reign with Christopher Daniels, and hey, how good must that be for someone to, to be, you know, that close to someone like Christopher Daniels? So I think it's one of the greatest wrestlers in the in the, in the world at the moment. Well, absolutely, and you used to manage him, of course, during Indeed. his time over here in the UK. Indeed, so. I did. Yes, Saito from uh, Yamagata, Japan, home of the greatest football fans in the world. If you don't know what I mean, just put Yamagata football fans into YouTube and, and watch and enjoy. And Rio Saito going to the top rope. Oh! Just drops all this weight with that double stomp. Nothing pretty, but very effective. Saito uh, used to be part of uh, the Do Fixer uh, faction in Japan, and uh, many Western fans will remember the mind blowing six man tag team match at uh, Ring of Honor Supercard of Honor alongside his Do Fixer teammates. Uh, however, recently he was turned on by his longtime tag team partner, Genki Horaguchi. And Saito is now part of the Typhoon faction. Well, I was fortunate enough to uh, be in Detroit at the beginning of this month. Actually, it was March 31st, to tell a lie, uh, for to, to witness oh, the six-man Dragon Gate match there. It's one of the best matches I've seen live in a long, long time. We're seeing the Dragon Gate style brought to Europe as part of the King of Europe Cup, courtesy of Rio Saito and uh, Matt Seidel really. I mean, obviously Matt Seidel representing IWA Mid-South, but... No stranger to Japan, Matt Seidel and Fisherman Buster rolls through. Oh, he likes to use this series of moves. Oh! And you know, it goes back to what we were talking about last night. When you're hit with a move you're not expecting, you can't brace your body. I know it's, we're talking split seconds, but even so, you brace your body if you know a move's coming. And, and you know, that would have taken Seidel completely by surprise and would really have knocked the wind out of him more than another suplex would have, because that is what he was bracing himself for. Beautiful spinning heel kick there, and absolutely, I agree. I mean, that was a variation of the Fisherman Express. Of course you should series, agree with me. Series of moves that uh, Rio Saito usually uses. Well, I'm not quite sure what exactly that was, but Matt Seidel was very pleased with the results. He nearly didn't get it, and I think that's what Seidel's happy with. He, I thought for a moment he wasn't going to clear the ring apron. That is why it's called high-risk moves, of course. And also, instead of uh, what you'll sometimes see Matt Seidel do is a, a twisting moonsault. Instead, he, he changed direction during that and landed almost on his side there on the top of Rio Saito. And Saito sent back into the top rope. Sorry, back into the ring. I was expecting Matt Saito to go to the top rope, maybe for a side out press. Oh, Cannonball! Leg drop, holds the arm down as well. Just off the middle rope, if he hit it from the top, maybe that would have been different. But Saito has now taken over. Yes no? That mean? high risk move, that dive out the ring has turned the tide of this match, Dan Reed. Now a few moves that uh, Matt Seidel needs to keep away from is including the premium bridge, which is that wrist lock dragon suplex hold, which we saw him defeat Jody Fleischmith last night. Yep. Uh, as well as the dancing Yahoo. The dancing Yahoo. Which is the hammerlock half crab and the messenger, which is the modified cradle. We've already seen a variation of the Fisherman Express. Isn't it great when things from Japanese don't quite translate properly? <laughs> Reminds me of a, an old show in Wing many years ago, which came out in translation as Dog in a Box. Beautiful. Running elbow. 
And again, off the middle rope. He almost slipped off that. Actually, didn't quite get the momentum he was looking for. Oh! Almost takes out our cameraman. Well, he went so hard, he went through the ropes. Springboard. Oh, but he got caught. Even the referee's grimacing at that one as Seidel is hung out to dry on the ropes. Our American referee now. Bryce Gutenberg. Rensburg. Him as well. Shouldn't we have a British referee? We've got an American and a Japanese. How can you trust the American referee to be impartial? Exactly. I agree. I, I was speechless. I had nothing to offer. Not nothing the first new. time, Reed. Beat you to it. Whoa! Beautiful! Oh! oh there's that moonsault again! Side now, moonsault press. Uh, without a doubt. Uh, the best moonsault in the business, in my opinion. Some might say it's the most prettiest. Indeed. Oh! oh! Mount Everest-style German suplex there, the way he holds you up before dropping, similar to what we saw with Goshi Ozaki earlier with Davy Richards. Indeed. Yes. No, I don't think it means indeed. I've heard them say indeed in Japanese. And now we just go for that. Dragon suplex. Oh. Victor Row into the into the ropes. Lucky for Rio Saito. Oh, that weren't too lucky. Wait a minute. Dragon suplex on the back of the head. Hits the ropes. Gets caught off with the forearm. Hits the ropes again. Oh, at that time he follows through on that clothesline. Turns him inside out. Dragon Jordan. suplex. No, wasn't able to lock the fingers behind the head. Did you see that Twisted Genius? He had to let go and just hold his arms down. Yeah. That allowed him to get their hands up and get those shoulders up before the three count. Position Saidao on the top rope, does Saito. And now he's going for that variation of the premium bridge off the top. No, is he going to go full on three for the jerk, for the... Dragon suplex. Oh, maybe he's going for that side down press. He used this last night. He hits it. One, two, three. And Matt, that's it. Matt Seidel advances to the semi-finals to face Doug Williams in the King of New Cup. Great match between Dragon Gate's finest and Rio Saito and representing IWA Mid-South, it's Matt Seidel.